the project started actually through an encounter between myself and Lamia Jrej, who's an artist, and I used to run a gallery. And uh, we started like just discussions where we were sharing our ideas, our frustrations a little bit, as, like her as an artist, not being able to have enough space in, in Lebanon to exhibit contemporary art, and me as a, and me as a, as a gallerist with all the commercial constraints that a gallery uh, uh, demands. The space was an old furniture factory, but it was completely abandoned for years. Uh, what we really liked about it is, is that it was the volumes were really interesting, yeah. and actually we didn't change a lot. Uh, you have to know also that when we opened, there was nothing around it. There were just like uh, the, the garage and uh, one or two uh, uh, carpenters. We were interested particularly in this area just because uh, the other industrial zones are further, whereas here we are still in the city. Actually, technically, you are still in Beirut. You cross the bridge and you are not, you are not We're anymore in the limit. We're on the limit, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay, the funny story is actually uh, the Mediatek is actually the reason how uh, and why Lamia and I met in 2004. Because when I used to run my, my, my space, uh, my, so my gallery, I wanted to add something regarding videos. Mm -hmm. And uh, Lamia being a videos and was quite, and we had, we had started this conversation at that time, I contacted her because I, I wanted her to uh, help me conceive a space where sure. people could uh, have access to videos from uh, Lebanese artists. So the idea of the Mediatek, as I say, it's, it's like a re digital resource center. It, it focuses on artists uh, from the Arab world plus uh, Turkey, Armenia, and Iran. The aim is not to be also like a, a huge uh, reference, I mean, not to include all the artists, you know. It's really, we've been you know, thinking and selecting these artists. When you enter a structure of a museum, uh, it demands really another structure, other fonts, other, and if you want to do a collection, you have to be able to preserve this collection, you have to be able to acquire work. So it's, it's, it has never been, and I think there is definitely a need for muse a museum or museums, uh, contemporary art, but it was not really not our, um, yeah our aim at the beginning. We really want to be a space more of a diffusion than of conservation. Projects for the future, uh, there's a lot of things. Uh, I mean, of course, the main, the main challenge is to maintain also the center's existence, its artistic direction, uh, its program of events, etc., which is not always easy in a, in a country like Lebanon. Um, of course, also now we've been thinking of, uh, I think after five years, you know, you're at one point where you have also to sit and think a little bit about uh, rethinking exactly. I mean, these five years were very like, we had a lot on, in our hands, we did a lot of, uh, of things, but now we want to look back, maybe rethink a little bit about our artistic direction and uh, rethink about our structure, etc. with the aim of, uh, uh, again, it's not, getting bigger it's not you know it's still it's a, it's a modest project it's not something and we i mean every time we did we did a project like this even with pompidou even when we had uh, an exhibition by gerhard richter even these exhibitions they were done in a in a, in a very different scale than you could imagine in another museum etc with much lo lower means and especially with the help of the artists that were all amazing and all these but we never wanted to do something related to identity. So then when we do thematic, etc., it's always more or less related to uh, concerns or issues that we feel are important uh, in, in, the, in Lebanon, in the region, etc. And even when we show artists like uh, Richter or we showed yeah. Chris Marker, etc., it's, it's also the, the reason why we want to show them because we, we think it's interesting to give access to the Lebanese public, to, uh, to these kind of artists who particularly work on issues 
that they could relate to. It's not, a, it's called Beirut Art Center, it's not a, a space for exactly. Lebanese artists only, but it's for the Lebanese public. So it's, uh, it's different. different.